play is quite interesting because very small children don't really play together with each other. They tend to play side by side. It's actually called parallel play by psychologists. And it's only once they get to about three that you'll find them playing cooperatively, you know, sharing and playing games together. You can encourage it if you take them to places where they get a chance to socialise and mix with other children. So, you know, little mother and toddler groups, uh, reading sessions at the library, uh, you know, little music groups, anything like that where they will mix with other children really encourages them to start doing that. Don't worry too much if your toddler is one that isn't happily playing with other children. Sometimes playing alone is, is an ideal way to learn about things. They might be in a little toy kitchen making the tea or, you know, baking a cake. And doing that, they won't necessarily play with another child, but there's nothing wrong with that. That's a useful playing opportunity too. It's important not to expect too much from toddlers. They don't necessarily know how to behave well until you tell them. So it's important again for you to teach them. If you're going to somebody else's house, the rules might be different and they may have to do things in a different way. So that's part of your job as a parent, is teaching them those social rules. But it all takes a, quite a long time and toddlers are not going to get it right all the time. I taught my child to share through just having, just when we were with friends and things with other kids and when she's at nursery that she has to share her toys and understand that you know she can't just keep everything she has to she has to share. We'll teach him try not to say you can take turn just wait for your brother to finish and then you can take it then when you finish you give it to your brother you two can take turn. It takes time but I think now he's slowly getting the idea. All toddlers go through what's called a negative phase. Their favourite word is no. They will very often do things that drive parents mad. The trick with it is not to keep saying no to them. The more they hear you say no, the more they think, oh, that's a good word to say. So if they're doing something you find unacceptable, you know, if your toddler gets a pen, starts writing on the wall, instead of screaming, no, don't do that, get them a piece of paper and sit them down and say, this is what you do with a pen. And then the more they can get it right, the more you can praise that and they actually want to keep on doing it. The really important things for the parent of a toddler to remember are about accepting and recognising their feelings, showing empathy for them. Also about being a positive role model yourself so they copy the way you behave and about encouraging and teaching, about sharing and playing cooperatively and giving them lots of opportunities to go out socially and learn how to do those things. Thank you.